What's up everybody? Yoshi here. I'm here at the shop obviously. Uh, today I'm gonna be doing a small thing to the Subaru. Nothing major. Uh, Anthony got a little package in the mail from a company. I'm sorry if I butcher the name. I am so sorry. Oh, Odro? Odro LEDs? They were kind enough to send me some fog lights for the STI. So, um, thank you, <laughs> first and foremost. Uh, but yeah, um, Doe's got these in the Honda on his fog lights. So I'm gonna pop them in here and I'm gonna show you how to do it real quick. I mean, this is a quick five minute, real dirty example. So I'm gonna show you before and after shot. I would have gotten the before shot of me driving on the road, but it was daytime, so sue me. All right, let's get started. Okay, so let's first things first, let's get a shot of the beginning here with the, oh shit, it's dark, hold on. <laughs> okay, well, let's get a preview of the, hey, what's up? Let's get a preview of the fog lights you know, just as they are. I mean, they're gonna be bright. It's dark as hell in here right now. So let's see what they look like now. Okay. Yeah, as you can tell, it's just a regular fluorescent light, nothing major. The LEDs really overpower it. I mean, it does the job, but in my opinion, just not good enough. Yeah. So let's go turn the lights back on, shall we? Hey, 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 fuck you, fuck you. This place is creepy as fuck at night. All right, cool. Look at that. Oh, those of y'all who always ask why we have so many Buicks in the shop, I'm just gonna get this over with now. We here at my job, my boss tends to specialize, quote unquote, in Buick Grand National. So we have this one here, we have these two over here. That one needs a motor, that one needs a motor, and that one needs to go the fuck away. But, yeah. So, let's go over here and let's get this done. I'm gonna cut this right here, and we'll get to the installation. Okay, let's pick her up. Now this is the time where Doe would usually fast forward. Is that a nail on my tire? Okay. Yeah, this is the time which though we usually fast forward through here. This is where I would normally jabber on and talk stupid when I'm not going to, because knowing my luck, he won't stop, he won't fast forward it and he'll just make me look stupid. To put these in, it's super easy. I've already kind of cheated, I'm not gonna lie, and I've already kind of got things undone and disconnected. So all you really gotta do is take off a couple of popper tabs. It's one, two, three pop tabs, there'd be one right here, and then there'd be a screw, a 10 mil screw right there. So once you get all four of those things out, you can pull this flap down here, and take your lights, and pick up my car here. Sorry for the mess, guys, whatever. Let's see, grab my flashlight. We can look in here and we can find the fog light, which is right there. So let's go ahead and disconnect the fog light. Real simple. And we're gonna turn this out. There you go. Yeah. Take the new Odoro light. Oh, I should have kept my light. I can't see now. I'm gonna pop it back in. Come on, you bad dude. Okay, so after figuring out which way these things need to go, now I can fully install my light. So you can just put this in here. And... Oh, well, I already got this one in. Uh, I'm stupid. Okay, well, 
as you can see, I already got this one installed because I'm an idiot. And after, let's see. And it just locks in, guys, just like that. And from there, just grab your pigtail. Pop in. And you're good to go. Let's go do this. I'm going to keep my light this time. Keep my light. Let's do this one handed, guys. Okay, that's one down. And there we go. Take the new auto light. Let's see. And we just go ahead and pop it in. Make sure we're oriented correctly. Because that's what stopped me last time. So I had a cut to it. Let's see here. Switch hands. And there we go. Ready to plug in. And that's basically it, guys. I mean, there's a basically, that is it. And my odor LEDs are plugged in. Now, we're gonna go ahead and get all my, yes, they're pink. Don't judge me. And what we're gonna do is put all of our pop tabs back in. Fix all of our stuff here so it doesn't look all janky. Sorry guys, if this is all shaky and whatnot, I'm doing this one-handed. But yeah, I'm gonna put this back together and One tab. There. Two tabs. One, three tabs. Mm, fine. Sorry, guys. I'm doing this one handed, y'all. Come on. Three tabs. And if y'all don't know, this little thing right here, not the gun, but the socket right here, you don't have to get the one that I have because mine's like a snap-on, super expensive. Come on. This is a 10 millimeter, as you can see, magnetic socket. Y'all have no clue how many times this has gotten me out of trouble, kept me out of trouble, so on and so forth. So just, and that's it. So I'm gonna put the other side back together, guys, and then, uh, We'll see what they look like. Okay, guys. All right, they're buttoned back up. Let's go ahead and lower the car. Let's go ahead and lower the car real quick. Uh, this is harder to do. Da -da -da. I can read some instructions while I'm doing this. The model number for this pump. Okay, and we're down. All right, so let's go turn the lights off again. I'll grab my big light this time. Well, let's see what these things look like. Dark again. Hey, hey, okay. All right, let's see what these fancy new LED fog lights look like. Look pretty good. I have an overall better coverage of everything. Looks really good. 
As you can tell, there's no more dumb yellow tinge, there's no more yellow glow. It's all this nice, crisp white light. Like I said, guys, the LEDs kind of, or the, the HIDs kind of overpower it. I'm sorry about that. But I like them. I'm very happy with them. Let's go for a test drive and see what they look like on the road. But there you go, guys. Thank you to Odoro for the for the awesome fog lights. Um, thanks to Doe for giving them to me. And uh, yeah, I'll catch up next time. And hopefully next time it won't be as anticlimactic. Yeah.